Hi my cyber angels, I'm Shah from Charlie's Angel Tarot and welcome back to the channel and uh, thank you very much for liking and sharing all the videos and coming into the life and if you are new and you've just landed on this page or this channel uh, welcome to this channel and I hope you will enjoy the readings and remember I also do weekly readings that's just one video for all the signs for every day and this is the personal reading for you for the whole week for your zodiac sign I'm just making a general introduction video so I'll try to keep it short as there is also new stuff news um, welcome like I said and please subscribe and hit the bell on all and then you'll be informed um, uh, or notified rather when something new happens when I go live or when new videos are loaded up there are also romance readings every month and uh, weeklies and uh, a separate one for all signs just see what resonates with you and take it from there and the news is that um, I'll be going live on face uh, on Facebook on Sunday the 2nd of August and it is on the page of online well-being mind body spirit fair the 2nd of August so join us there it is at 11 till 1900 British Standard Time and on the Eastern Time it is 6 o'clock in the morning until 1400 and I'll repeat that 11 o'clock to 7 o'clock in the evening British Standard Time and 6 o'clock till 2 o'clock Eastern Time and I hope you will enjoy that there are loads of cyber stalls because uh, there are a load of participants that are selling their wares or showing you uh, what they do like tarot readers uh, Reiki Masters, Meditations, I'm coming in with the Lenaman. So come and join me, I'm going live at 12.40 um, that is um, the uh, Dutch time and 6.20 in the evening till 7 o'clock um, also so keep a scout around you can find me under Charlie's Angel and uh, perhaps the times might be different so excuse me if I got the time wrong because in England it is an hour early and it's an hour later for me so please join me in the online well-being mind body spirit fair tomorrow the 2nd of August and that is one bit of news and the second bit of news is that I have got a new page it's called Charlie's Angel Crowd on Facebook and there um, we can interact really much better than just the chat and there will be meditation groups uh, workshops uh, other things happening there it is a private group so remember that if you do join you don't have to join in all the live sessions but it is called the rooms or the space and there you can see each other but you can always uh, switch off your video camera and take place so um, if you do join that group please respect the privacy of others and I do not take uh, uh, discrimination or of any kind or pesting likely then one will get disqualified deleted without notice or warning so if you would like to uh, join the private group then please join us and I've also got out two new reviews on two books uh, which I'm going to use with an English witch and a Dutch witch I'm going to make the new series with Wendy um, on the, the healthy witch and the workplace spell and um, everyday magic on the job so have a look at these two reviews and see if you would like to join me with Wendy or with the other witch the Georgina 
in English there will be in two languages and there will be a new series so I'm doing a live review on YouTube with Wendy and with Georgina so here we go and we're going to start off with your reading thank you for being here and remember this is a general reading if it doesn't resonate with you then please look at your moon sign or your rising sign I love you love from cyber mom and big cyber hugs and I hope to see you back if you're a cyber angel in the live sessions and if you can't join us because of holiday or any other reason enjoy your holiday stay safe and stay well Hi Aries, this is your reading for the 3rd to the 9th. The first card you've got is the Page of Pentacles and you will be receiving news. This could be an offer of a job or about um, anything that's durable and for long term. Also something that is tangible like you might have applied for a job, you might have applied for a mortgage or anything like that, you will get news that you have the mortgage, that you've got the job or they, you can come in for a job interview. <coughs> uh, you could also be meeting a Virgo, Capricorn or a Taurus as it is the a page of pentacles. It could be a person younger than you or it could be a young person like a teenager then you have the nine of vessels so that's the nine of cups your wish or goal is coming true so the news will be related to a wish or a goal that uh, will come true and nine is also an ending so news about a new beginning where there is an ending there is a new beginning you are moving up from a nine to the ten of cups happy families reunion with family and friends your cup is fulfilled filled up or running over wow and um, I see the rainbow here as well so perhaps you might be receiving a sign of somebody that is your guardian angel or somebody that is um, looking after you and protecting you from the other side because the rainbow means to me connection between heaven and earth wow celebrations big time especially if your wish is coming true also 10 is an ending again where there is an ending there is a definite beginning so there will be a beginning a new beginning of some kind in the middle of the week then we have the nine of stones <laughs> you've got one of the best cards and the nine of stones is the nine of pentacles so you're leaving um, uh, uh, what you call it you're leaving a less fortunate period and you're going into a voluptuous rich emotional joyful period where there will be celebrations emotionally and materially you might have felt stuck you might uh, felt imprisoned but now you can break open and break loose but be take care and be careful don't run before you can walk that is what I'm hearing um, you are emotionally fulfilled because your dream has come true perhaps you might be extending the family or getting married because now you have the finances to support the new house um, your new family and perhaps you might want to expand the family it doesn't have to be necessarily with a child it can also be with a pet a dog or a cat for now but there's definitely loads of new beginnings and then you have the Knight of Cups the Knight of Cups um, could be a Cancer Scorpio or a Pisces that you might be meeting up with but you will get a news this could be a job offer or an offer of love or an offer of marriage whoopee yeah beautiful reading Aries 
Okay, then you have the two of bows. That means partnering up. This could be in business or in love. The two of bow bows is the two of wands. And uh, you are also making plans for the future. Ye yes, definitely, if I look at all the other cards, you might be making plans to expand the family or the business. Wow, that's at the end of the week. And at the weekend, you've got the Wheel of Fortune. The Wheel of Fortune is what goes up must come down. Also, taking up a next level or going up a next level in uh, partnerships or business or in love or at work, you might be getting a promotion. Wow, this is definitely good all round. Again, coming full circle, going into a new face. You might be moving home, like I said, this could be the news about the mortgage. Well, this card means moving home or going on holiday. Absolutely gorgeous, and this is also my karma card. If you've done good or bad, it will be returned threefold. By the looks of it, you've been doing good, so you are getting it back threefold. Definitely with all these cards, like Nine of Cups, the Wish card, one. Ten of Cups, two. And now you've got the Wheel of Fortune. Your fortune is going up, 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 up. And also recognition. If somebody's done you wrong or good, they'll get it back threefold, too. Then we have the King of Stones. And stones means pentacles. So everything that you touch will uh, turn out into gold or positive. Okay, you have done the work, you have invested wisely, you've abided your time, taking step by step, and now you are the King of Stones. That is the King of Pentacles. So the King of Pentacles is Taurus, but don't exclude Virgo or Capricorn. But prominently, the King of Pentacles is Taurus. So if you are not hooked up, you could meet a Taurus, or a Virgo, or a Capricorn. Whoopee! Nice, nice, nice. This is the most positive reading that I've had up till now, Aries. The angel card you have is a lime green angel feather. And this card, I didn't pick them, honestly, I swear to you. Money is about to be manifested or to be manifested. The angels ask that you feel the marvelous feeling of anticipation as you are about to receive abundance of money. The lime green angel feather pre is presented to you as a symbol of prosperity. Lime green is a mixture of yellow and green. The angels applaud your ability to make a connection with the universal source of abundance through your practice of prosperity prosperity thinking, affirmations and meditation. In times of economic uncertainty, it is f vital that you can transcend all negative information present in the media and from people surrounding you who are filled with fear. It requires diligent practice to create your own system of prosperity. But once this is achieved, you will thrive. The angels ask that you feel excited and make room for all that is rich, magnificent and wonderful. Your future is absolutely glorious potential. Just look at this reading. Wow, it is so beautiful. All the money cards and happiness are lying here. Whether it's in business or in your private life or in your love life, you have the best reading so far. And again, going on holiday, your boat of abundance is coming in. Three, you've been creative and you are rising above the negative energy. You have taken the ship and you are flying above the mountains, the mountains representing problems. And you've got the 
you've got the Ten of Spades here, and that's the Ten of Swords. You have you have come so far, you're not taking any BS. If anybody stabs you in the back, you're done with it. Ten is an ending, and you are so strong and powerful. You're standing in your strength if you look at your reading and your wishes come true. You are not taking any BS and uh, you're not uh, giving anybody a second chance. You have done with untrustworthy situations and people. You are flying high above all kinds of problems. You stand above that and you are going into a new beautiful beginning. Wow! So you have, um, let's have a look, a 10 here, and you've got the 10 there, so you've got uh, uh, two, angel, uh, two numbers, 10, so the angels are showing you, you've come full circle, okay, you deserve what you are going to get, happiness and fulfillment and st um, stability, that's great stuff money is coming your way okay I hope you've enjoyed this reading if you doesn't resonate with you then please look at your rising sign or your moon sign stay safe be blessed and I love you all take care thank you for watching the video I hope you enjoyed it and remember have a wonderful day and don't forget to subscribe and hit the bell on all and I'll see you in the life, Monday, Wednesday or Friday. Ciao, ciao.